hello friends today in this tutorial i'll be showing you that how to add the png and gif animation images inside your pdf document using js pdf library so basically these images will be fit inside the pdf document page size it will be perfectly fit to the full size of the pdf document so let me show you a very basic example that i have created here you will see this is a png image here this is a png all the images are transparent with the transparent background this is a gif image so all these two images will be added inside the two pages of the pdf document if i click the download pdf button so you will see that a pdf document as the attachment will be downloaded if i open this pdf document you will see perfectly all the two images will be perfectly sized up inside the page document of the pdf document this is the first page you can see the image size is perfectly aligned to the uh, page uh, size of the pdf and this is the second one you can see perfectly this this is a second image which is a gif image it has a green background so now you can see perfectly it is taking all the space of the pdf document so that's exactly the behavior that we will need for this application so let's start building this application from scratch guys so let me delete all the code here and start from scratch if you want the full source code of this tutorial guys i have written a complete blog post on my website i have given that link in the video description so this is the blog post i have written here you can see this is a blog post you can go to the video description link to download all the source code so this is a blog post all the source code is given so let's start building this application guys so for this we will have a simple button inside of a body we will have a simple button which will say download pdf so now it also we have a on click so when we click this button this download pdf function will execute so for this we need to write the custom javascript so here we will write this function which is download pdf so here what we need to do is that we need to initialize the new instance of a js pdf like this and after that guys what we need to do is that we need to get the base 64 code of the png image and the gif image so the first way by which you can add images to your pdf document is using the base 64 code so every image has a unique base 64 code there are many tools out there which lets you convert your image to base 64 code so simply what you can do is that you can go to my video description to download all the source code that source code is given so you can copy paste the base 64 for this png image and the gif image that's it so after doing this guys the next step will be very simple you need to calculate the width and the height of the page pdf document page this is very simple it provides the method by which you can calculate this so we can declare a variable of width and we can simply use doc dot internal dot so this has a method here if you see here let me show you let me show you this doc dot eternal that page size page size dot get width this is a method by which you can get the full width of the calculate the width of the pdf document page and similarly you can calculate for height page size dot get height so this is a logic every page will be different different so it will automatically dynamically calculate the width and the height of the pdf document page and depending upon that guys now we can add the images so in order to add the image to the pdf document we have this method add image so simply you need to pass the base 64 code so this will be for first i will pass for png and then this is a png image so we will write png and uh, x and the y coordinate will be 0 comma 0 and we need to span the entire width and the entire height that's it 
After that, you need to add a new page, second page. This is a method by which you can add a new page, doc.add page. And then we will add the second image in the second page. So we will add this next image, octocat. octocat so gif this needs to be capital so this is a gif image a gif image so gif 0 comma 0 again we need to pass the width and the height and lastly guys we need to save this so we can simply save it by any name so i can just give it as uh, file.pdf that's it so this is your application guys so if i run this application click on download pdf so you will see file.pdf will be downloaded and this these are the two images which are successfully inserted on the pdf document with their full width and full height so you can do it like this you can take any image for example there are many tools out there which converts the image to base 64 so you can just search for image to base 64 so this is the encoder which is there so you can drag and drop your image whichever image you want to convert let's suppose i select this image so it will show you this base 64 code so now you can copy this code instead of this if you want to so just paste it here so now if I once again refresh the application now you will see the image will be changed you will see this is the image which is placed full width and full height you will see so it is fitted to the page width and page height so you you can't see any sort of uh, white space out there because we are fully calculating beforehand the width and the height of the page and then we are correspondingly we are fitting the image based upon that so you can take any jpg image png image if you are taking the jpg image you just need to replace here jpg just change it like this so this is all about base 64 code you need to just calculate the base 64 code of the image and then you can easily insert the image inside your pdf document using jspdf so i have shown you the complete example guys if you have any sort of problem in uh, doing this you can go to the video description link to download all the source code i have given that source code in my blog post so go to the video description and download all the source code please hit the like button subscribe the channel and i will be seeing you in the next video